Hi, my name is Bart Spencer. I've been working for Pyrocore now in the waste to energy industry for about 10 years. And uh, this is our waste to energy plant on our system. We have this conveyor, conveyor here because we had some issues feeding our plant with waste and conveyor helped us out getting that sorted. The <laughs> problem is we designed our own conveyor system and it was a chain link system which didn't work particularly well. We had a feed conveyor and we also had a uh, conveyor that was taking the product away. The issue with the product one was that we couldn't seal it. This one here we can bulk feed so we can put a batch of material into this um, conveyor whereas before we had to feed it manually constantly from a uh, bulk store and the bulk store was um, not fit for purpose for what we wanted really so this was actually a perfect um, fix for us because we can we can fit two and a half tons or 2.5 meters cubes of waste into it and just let it do its thing it's a fantastic piece of kit it's great yeah. Covea was a really good experience the guys came over they put it all together three guys just flew through it I think it took about six or seven hours to put it together probably less than that there was some a, a wiring problem and the guy literally just went back to the office got the part came back and fitted it we couldn't we couldn't be happier to be honest so really good we never have any any issues with this with this system we've got it on inverters so we can vary the speed of the motors it's really really versatile for what we want yeah, it's fantastic so we have a new um, system we're building at the moment. This, our system here is a 50 kilo uh, an hour machine and the system we're building called the Phoenix is a 500 kilo an hour system. And Covea are supplying us with the uh, new conveyor for that as well. It's a testament really to what we think about this equipment. So if, if we didn't like it, we wouldn't buy another one. <laughs> this system, this is a waste to energy plant basically using pyrolysis we heat the waste to a temperature of around anything between 800 and 1000 degrees it's being broken down into its components then the hydrogen is reused so we run the plant on its own waste because once you have seven eight nine hundred um, degrees of waste heat there are tons of options so that's what we're doing <laughs>